Synthetic hair, like human hair, is a polymer. It's composed of fine plastic fibers manufactured to look like human hair. In its basic form, synthetic hair is made from low-grade acrylic that is heated and strung into strands to make individual fibers. These strands are then laced or tied into extensions and hair pieces. Over the last past 20 years, polymer science has advanced massively to create these synthetic hair fibers and enabled wig manufacturers to offer broader lines of synthetic hair products that can look and feel like the real thing. Lower grade synthetic hair fibers can be found in costume wigs and lack the movement and texture of real hair. Additionally, the appearance of these fibers is waxy and plastic. The higher grade, more sophisticated form of synthetic hair has texture, luster, and resembles human hair. The fibers range in type from straight to kinky curly with coarse surfaces to silky smooth surfaces. In some cases, it's difficult to tell the difference with some of the higher quality synthetic pieces. You would never know if they were not natural human hair if you didn't have the human hair right next to it to compare. Cacoline fibers is certainly the most prevalent and popular for daily wear wigs and hair pieces. This fiber is characterized by a natural feeling, lighter, softer hair with more natural body that is both flexible and comfortable. While some women are immediately put off by the idea of wearing a synthetic wig, there are many plus points to consider before ruling out these wigs entirely. Synthetic wigs are generally easier to take care of due to the permanent styling. A shake and brush is all it takes to maintain the pre-styled look and the wig can be worn with no fuss or bother. Women who do not want to be bothered with styling a wig on a daily basis may prefer a synthetic wig. For some women, escaping the daily hair care routine is the reason they want to wear a wig in the first place. So a human hair wig would defeat the purpose. Human hair wigs will eventually fade while synthetic fibers retain their color permanently. Of course, this may also be considered a negative point by some women as synthetic wigs cannot be successfully colored. Synthetic wigs are almost always less expensive than those that's made from human hair with a broad variety of styles and cuts ranging from $100 to $400, allowing women to purchase more than just one wig at a time without breaking the bank. Synthetic hair wig purchasers have never had it so good. Hundreds of fine quality styles and cuts are available from the largest and most respected wig manufacturers in the industry with a broad array of colors. It is easier to find your style, cut, and color of choice than ever before. Recent advances in technology have eliminated a lot of the traditional barriers to synthetic hair wigs. Quality is reliable and good. It is at least worth checking them out before automatically going to get a wig made of human hair. Now let's talk about the cons. Synthetic wigs have their downsides, which should be honestly considered before making a wig buying decision. Despite advances in technology, high quality synthetic wigs can still look unnatural in direct light. 
or in the ways that they move. Although the differences are subtle, there is still a tendency towards a less flowing and a more sculpted appearance. With lower grade synthetic wigs, the differences in shine and flow can be quite distinct and easy to spot. Some women find the permanent set of a synthetic wig to be a bonus, while others are turned off by this. If a woman is into her looks, likes varieties, and becomes bored with the same hairstyle day after day, or fears that people will suspect she is wearing a wig, a synthetic wig may not be the right option. Options for coloring synthetic hair wigs are limited and not entirely without risk. The synthetic wig must be dyed with ink. So if a regular hair dye is used, he or she risks the dye running off and bleeding because synthetic wigs have hair that do not absorb a regular hair dye like human hair. Constant rubbing on the collar can lead to irritation and synthetic hair wigs are less able to breathe than human hair wigs. It can be hot and itchy in warm weather. And lastly, synthetic wigs made from calcaline are termed heat resistant up to around 400 degrees. For styling using curlers and tongs at low heat, there is no problem. But do remain mindful that synthetic hair is a polymer and it can and will melt at extreme heat. Exposure to open ovens and heat lamps can damage synthetic wigs beyond repair. And as always, thanks for watching. Also, don't forget to hit that like button, hit that notification bell, and most importantly, subscribe. Bye-bye. Mwah.